Hello guys, Zuljin here. Welcome back to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Guys, thank y'all so much for all the awesome support. I am I'm I'm over the moon about how excited you guys are about the double episodes that I'm putting out now. I have a couple days left to do this. I'm ending it Friday will be the last day of the double episodes. So I hope you guys are okay with that. Like I can't possibly keep this schedule up. It's crazy and I'm it's I'm 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 spending all day in my office nowadays and I need to get out a little bit. In fact, Friday I think I'm taking a day off, but that's not gonna stop the uploads. But anyway, I really just want to say thanks for all the support you guys. As always, if you do enjoy the videos, give me some dap on that like button to show you support and you can also subscribe to the channel for more daily videos so there's still spoilers at the main base so we aren't going to be going there today what i need i'm out here with hot wings and hot wings has been getting a little bit of levels he's doing really good actually let's check oh she is doing really good i'm sorry let's check out the stats right quick so i brought it her over a thousand health uh, she's right at 500 melee damage, and I haven't tweaked anything else yet. And with the melee damage the way it is now, since she's not all fighting, I'd like her to be a little bit more well-rounded because she's a great hunting buddy. But um, I do want to be able to mount her, and I think with the weight, the current weight, the setup it is, it's not going to be that great. Now I do have a Tyranodon as well, but my Tyranodon is strictly made for speed, so we don't have to worry too much about speed. Uh, on hot wings due to its level. It's not going to be a perfect tame or anything like that naturally. I just want her to be a good well-rounded bird so that I can hunt with her and tame with her really. So I think today we're going to go for a saddle. Now I've been hunting out here a little bit with her and grabbing a bunch of chitin and we've got enough to do that finally. And I don't think I need a smithy for this recipe. So let's go down and look for the Argentava saddle. There's Sarko, there's Mammoth, Anklo, it should be Argentava Saddle, there it is. Alright, and if I'm not mistaken, uh, let's go to Show All, Saddles, and let's see, Argentava Saddle. So I'm going to need 185 fiber and some hide as well. Now I don't have hardly any hide, in fact, I don't think I have any. Yeah, I don't really have any. I have plenty of keratin and fiber, so I shouldn't have to worry about that. Uh, but we should be able to do some hide hunting here. So let's get on Hot Wings. Well, not get on him, but let's go a little bit further out. And now that I can make this thing, we just need to get a little bit of hide. Now, I was thinking about going up toward the mountain today, but I think I'm just going to roam by the beach because there has been a lot of stuff around the beach. And I'd like to see if there's a trilobite or two or a trilobite or two. Some people call them different things. Uh, but I want to make sure that if there is a trilobite or two that I can grab a little bit of pearls and oil because I would like to start getting a little bit of jerky. Nothing major, not for like perfect tames or anything, but mostly just for a kibble or two for the hard to tame herbivores would be great. Um, and also maybe a little bit of oil a little bit later for gas. We don't, we don't know. But anyway, I know it's one of those resources that we haven't gotten a whole bunch of yet. So I'm going to do a little bit of exploring on the beach. Look at this mess right here. Um, <laughs> I think, I don't know what level these guys are, but this would be a lot of hide. I think maybe hot wings will be prepared for this. Let's see here. Let's try it out. We'll probably be able to take a couple of them out really quick. There we go. Okay, there's one. All right. There's another one. If I can probably get around and kill that, it won't be mate boosted anymore. There it is. No more mate boost. Okay. See, I like fighting on foot like this, but <laughs> I really do need a mount. As you can see, the way that I'm wearing armor and stuff right now, it gets pretty complicated really, really fast. So I want to avoid that. This should be enough hide from these three. Uh, this is going to be quite a bit. And I'm pretty sure my bird got plenty too. All right, let's see. Hot wing, stop. Stop, baby. <laughs> Relax. Let's see. I need to eat a little bit too. Thank you. Okay, so we have 71 hide, and I already had quite a bit. Let's go ahead and grab a stack of fiber off here too. And it looks like we're still short on hide. <laughs> wow, man. Okay, so maybe a little bit more hunting is involved here. What can I... Oh. Nope, I'm dodging that. This will be a little bit, but I wish I saw some Fiomias around here. Ah, there's one now. 
We should be able to kill that. That Those give a lot of hide, usually, as well. Naturally, Brontos and Rex is doing stuff like that. Ooh, and some more chitin wouldn't hurt. I still haven't seen any of the, um... The Trillobites. Now, I know they spawn in the middle of the ocean now, too, I've been seeing. Wow, look at the Meganora. Well, this is going to solve our chitin problems for a little while, isn't it? Uh, where did I leave Hot Wings? Hot Wings! These things better not kill me. <laughs> Alright, come on, Hot Wings. <laughs> I don't know what you're doing over there. I guess it's my bad for leaving you, but... Alright, let's harvest a little bit of this. This is going to be quite a bit of kite right here. 94, 116. See, a lot of people don't like Meganors, and I really don't either, but... It is really nice being able to get kite like this. Alright, there's a couple more to form. Last season we had a cat in a cave, and they did really, really good for that too. Uh, let's get these. All right, we should be good now. Okay, now let's see what we can do right here. You ready, Hot Wings? Thank you, baby. Good job. All right, how many hide will we get? Plenty, I told you. <laughs> Fiomius, man. Hide, hide, hide. Okay, this is the Pterodon saddle or Pteranodon saddle. We need a little bit more hide to go. We should be able to get that relatively quickly. Uh, here's another dealer. We'll go ahead and take these guys out too, just because they're easy. Eight more right there. And only three right there. Another Fiomia, which has put us right over the limit. And I can't see anything right now. Okay. Any more Fiomias. I don't know much about the... Uh, the witchy calls here. The Parasaurs. 56? Uh, we might as well try it. Quick kill. With the pikes, man, it's not that bad. Yeah, the parasaurs give quite a bit of hide too. So is that gonna be enough? Yes, yes, yes. Crowning achievement, guys. Let's see. How much experience is this gonna give me? I got twenty two ninety-four. Come on. <laughs> twenty two ninety-four. Two. Twenty four seventy five. That's a good little boost for a saddle. Come on, hot wings. There you go, baby. Look at that. We're gonna have to dye this red. You know we will. <laughs> okay. How's your how's your health, baby? No, not that bad. Good. Alright. We can fly a little bit. Oh, this is so good. It's slow, but I have a feeling that has a lot to do with the weight right now. So weight is at 166 out of 3 to 5. Nope, that's just the general movement speed. It's been a while since I've been on one. That was uh that was really, really slowed down. Uh, but this is great. Now we can fly around a little bit. I think since I have metal tools, it wouldn't be that bad to go around and searching for a little bit of trilobites. That way when we see one, we can harvest it up. So let's try on the black sand here and see if I could find anything. Also, the other day in some comments, guys, a few people were saying that I cursed. <laughs> so listen, sometimes I say things a little funny. And if I can, comes out very fast, and it sounds like the unmentionable. So, when I say if I can, like if I can go to the store, <laughs> or if I can get this mammoth down, it just happens to sound like I'm cursing, and it's not. So don't don't read too far into it, you guys, and don't make it a big deal. I don't curse on this channel because it's not appropriate. I don't think it's about gaming, you know. And I just don't roll like that. There's plenty of other channels that do curse or whatever. So every once in a while it slips out. I try not to make it like that. But I hope you guys are okay with uh, hearing the occasional one here and there. But it's usually not out of my mouth. It's just something that I forget to edit out. I'm pretty good about keeping it under wraps. So we're getting a little bit close to the base again. And I haven't seen any of these trilobites. Maybe I should go towards the ocean and see if there's any that I could see there. So I recruited Tiny's help. For some trilobite hunting. Time to kill bugs. Where you went? How I go trilobite I, hunting. How did I miss you, big old black self? 
<laughs> I'm in the water. Oh, you're in, in the water. water. You're in the water hunting for trilobites. Yeah, I killed trying to kill one. So have you seen them uh you have you seen them spawn on the ocean floor yet? Yeah, yeah, they spawn on the ocean floor. That's mm -hmm. kind of weird, huh? So beaches and yep. ocean floor, that's what I got so far. Yeah. Um so my hope was you've been pumping melee damage, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. I lost you now. So I'm I'm on the same side of the beach as we killed the other one. Okay, I'll come down there then. And what I want to see is if like I know they clamped the resources a while back. I want to see what the clamping is like. Like, cause I know your melee damage is a lot higher than mine. Mine's what's yours? Uh oh, like it's one ten or something like that. Uh, yeah, no, mine's one twenty five. One twenty five. All right. Two twenty five. So let's kill this guy without harvesting anything. Did you harvest anything? No. He didn't die. Okay. I was just making sure he wasn't just sliding. All right. There we go. Okay. Now he dead. So I'm gonna hit him with. An axe. One time. I got two oil, 20 chitin, and two raw meat. You hit him with an axe. I got eight chitin, four oil, and one raw meat. And we both used an axe on it. Okay, yeah. so... I think it was used up, though. Okay, so you definitely... Okay, we'll, we'll repeat the same test next one, and I'd like to try a pick, too. Because we got to figure out the science of this. The science, uh, the trilobite science. Oh, I meant to show you something really, really cool, too. Did what? you just poo in the water a little bit? I don't know. Maybe. All right, try this. So press K. Nailed it. And look at, like, rotate your camera into where you're looking down into the to the beach. Like underneath? Like, no, like above your head. Okay. Now looking you can down, see trilobites it. in the water oh, without worrying about the reflections. Cam. Yeah, Trial by cam. it's really, really good like this. I have reflections, though, so it makes it hard. I have a little bit of reflections. I think night makes it a little bit harder, but I was yep. looking for stuff earlier like this, and it seems oh, here's to work one. out pretty good. Oh, good, good. Now this guy's just level two. Okay, I don't... You think that... that You think the harvestability is different? I don't know. Let me All see. Right. I'm going to hit with an axe. What'd I got 31, 31 chitin, three silica pearls, and then I missed the rest. <laughs> Crap. Oh. <laughs> All right, there's another trilobite here. This one's just a level right. three. Here we go. I'm going to read it out to you. All right. 38 chitin, three raw meat, four oil. Okay. So, so I'm getting around 30 chitin, four oil every time. All right. And I wonder deal. if the pick is different. Let's. There's another couple that we can kill here. Oh, I didn't mean to stab you in your Yeah, foot. just destroy me. It's fine. <laughs> just kill my face off. Hey, what's attacking me, Dillo? The Lafatoris. Jump attack! <laughs> you missed. <laughs> Alright. So, uh, let me try with a pick now. So, pick is going to give 10 chitin, 5 raw meat, 2 silica pearls. 28 chitin, 4 raw meat, 2 silica pearls, 1 oil. 1 chitin, 1 raw meat. I think that there's a pool. I th Well, first of all, I think that it, it seems to be equal for axe or pick. Uh -huh. That's what it feels that way. I also feel like there's there's a pool of resources. I don't know if this is true or not, but it feels like there's a pool of resources inside of any creature. Like, so when you kill the trilobite, you can you get know, up to certain amounts of whatever. There's a certain amount of chitin I can get out of this one. Right. And, you know, I just got 26 chitin, 8 oil, 4 on me. So I, I bet it's like a scale. I bet there's like, you know, you get 25 to 31 of this and, you know, four to eight of that. Well, what I was I thinking know. about, yeah, because those are a little bit different because they aren't amplified by melee damage. And I just wanted to test that. But from from the looks of it right now, dude, it looks like we can get more silica pearls with picks and more oil with an axe. Did it seem that way? Yep. yep. Okay. How much silica pearls have you gotten so far? Since uh, you've been out nine here. and twenty-one oil. Uh, so I've gotten seven oil and three silica pearls. May and I've I've only harvested one of these things with uh with my pick. Like I just got five oil, three silica pearls from that one, and that seems to be about the same as what I was getting with the axe. Huh. Maybe maybe that's the thing then. Maybe it's either or. Maybe if you harvest them, no matter what. Another thing we can try is the pike. Here's one see, you there's get. a couple here. I'll kill these two. Uh, why did I get... 
just, I just got a dog out of nowhere. <laughs> All right. All right you, so you did the pick. One oil, two silica pearls. Oh, five oil and three silica pearls, I think. But I don't think you're getting any chitin with the pick. Two with silica. Oh, I'm getting I'm getting chitin too. And oh, you oil are? and silica pearls. Huh. Oh yeah. I don't think it's a difference in 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 all three of them now. I think it's just it just kind of gives you whatever. Just gives you whatever it is. Oh, there you have it, folks. If y'all have any uh, difference in uh, your experiments, please let us know because I'm interested to see. No, no pikes. No pikes. No pikes. Punch me in the face. Oh, 13.6 topor. All right. Now you just bring up your menu. There you go, just like yeah. that. You ready? Uh huh. Thirty-one point five two four. Oh baby, so that's that multiplier. Mm hmm. <laughs> oh. Get knocked out. <laughs> Get knocked out, son. Get knocked out. <laughs> what are you doing to me? Now you see how it feels to be king of the mountain, like I was on the last server. Get knocked out, son. Why do you think I'm pumping melee damage? <laughs> See, just so you can fight this me. Is, this was my long con. <laughs> I've been planning this one now for six months. <laughs> Get knocked out, son. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys. We are back from Trilobite hunting with Tiny, and I don't have a whole lot of oil. And he had to log out. Let's see if I could get up here. There he is. Is that him? Yep, yeah, that's him. Where did he put the oil? Did he put it down here? Uh, will you let me down, game? That's all blueprints. Oh, I forgot. I've been getting some other blueprints. I gotta add to it here. Yes, there's some flak blueprints in there. I see them. We'll get to it. We'll get to it. Okay. Let's see where he put this oil. Tiny, where did you put the oil? I need it. There's so much chitin and hide in here and stuff. Uh, stone and saddles. Seeds and stuff. There's some more oil. There we go. Okay, so this is what I'm gonna do. What is he? <laughs> Drax is ridiculous. Okay, this is what we're gonna do here. I'm going to put this up here because I don't want to go outside and spoil everything, right? What the heck? Oh, he's throwing smoke grenades. <laughs> he's so crazy. All right. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to be able to place in here now. <laughs> I'm glad it wasn't a stink bomb or something. Okay. So, where is this, uh... I can craft this now. Ingram preserving bin. And I'll put down the preserving bin. And this is going to be for jerky only. So, let's see here. This should be a good spot for it needs to be a little closer to the corner here perfect all right and I've gotten some spark powder as well and we'll put all of our cooked meat to start the process because each jerky takes a 1.5 hours uh, so we'll put the spark powder in here the oil in here and the cooked meat and let's see we have 55 pieces of oil so really and truly we would need 55 meat I could grab like 55 more I think let's see does Tiny have more meat on him that I can grab? Who else has meat? It's going to rot on their carcasses anyway. Uh, <laughs> everything not to spoil is what I'm going for. Ah, there's Tiny. There we go. 22. Ah, still all you meat. But it's jerky, so it's all good. Um, <laughs> or it's going to be jerky. So there we go. There we go. Okay, actually they're on different spoil timers, so I think I'm going to have to combine it like this. 23 there's 30 and 24 so that's 54 that's close enough <laughs> so all of this is going to be uh, jerky after we finish and what I'm really hoping for is to maybe grow some rock carrots uh, there is a little forming setup outside so I want to grow some rock carrots and I want next episode to make at least one piece of kibble so we can go and find a saber tooth tiger I need a house cat for an upcoming build hope you guys enjoyed the episode as always if you did please give me some dap on that like button to show you support you can always subscribe to the channel for more daily videos thanks so much for watching as always this is Uljin signing off and we'll see you next time.